Hey everybody, it's Elijah here. I want to make this video about GABA receptors and the difference between cold turkeying a benzo versus tapering to kind of give an analogy on the difference. I'm going to use grass <laughs> and a brick as an example. So grass is going to be the GABA receptors and the brick as the benzo. So we're going to go Take a look at this now. Imagine each piece of grass is a GABA receptor and you got this brick. So let's say I go cold turkey on this. Look, look at all these down-regulated GABA receptors. And look, they're not going up quickly. They will eventually come back up, but look, they're smushed. They're down-regulated. That's why cold turkey is not good. These pieces of grass will eventually come back up, but it's gonna take a while for them to lift back up to their normal state. I'm gonna show you a video of tapering now. I'm gonna put a brick on the grass, and when you taper, slowly, While some of the pieces of grass are still down, you're left with a lot of pieces that are up. So it's uh, much better to taper slowly because your GABA receptors can adjust to the reduction in medication. So I would rather do a slow taper and having my GABA receptors come up versus being completely smashed and having to give it a long time to upregulate. So that's just an analogy I wanted to share with you using a brick and grass with the grass acting as the GABA receptors.